so I thought I might do that somewhere else position than I normally would. I just want to say, I really, you know, I feel like it did, I realize, let's see, people, you know, every day somebody's dying and going to hell. So if you don't know the, gonna, in hell there's people who don't know the Lord, they just rejected the salvation, they rejected something Jesus Christ, you know. It's sad a thing if somebody's always dying and going to hell, so you need to reach out and make sure, and just turn like the Lord because somebody's dying and going to straight to hell. Somebody is not, you know, you don't have to go to that place, you just accept Jesus Christ and you believe on him. You shall have eternal life, you know. And you have to have him in your heart, you know. You have to repent every sin, what you do daily. You have to always repent for your sins because you're going to sin. You know, we all fall short in the glory of God. You don't have to keep sinning, but you just don't. You're not going to. No man is on this earth is perfect. God didn't, Jesus didn't expect you to be perfect. He just wants you to work on it and not keep sinning, you know. It makes me sad to think somebody on this earth is dying and going to hell. You know, it kind of brings tears to my eyes, thinking somebody doesn't know the Lord. And I just hope somebody just... Satan's going to tempt you. He did, he's going to tempt... He's just going to tell you lies and tell you lies about different things, you know. He's just going to... He's going to tempt you. Whatever your weakness is, he's going to tempt you. If your weakness is drugs, he's going to tempt you on drugs. If your weakness is alcohol, he's going to tempt you on alcohol. He's going to tempt you. If somebody that smokes, he's going to tempt you on smoke. He's going to always bring out your weakness, you know. Satan knows your weakness, and he's going to tempt you with your weakness. And he's going to tempt you to get distracted until he don't want you. Satan does not want anybody to get close to God. He don't want you to get a relationship with God. He don't want you to get closer to God. Because when you build, when you read and pray, when you build a relationship with God, and you, you start living for Christ, Satan does not like it when you live for Christ. You know, he's gonna he's gonna do anything in his power to stop you from getting close to God. So I just I want to throw that out there.